Let's review the features of the Outlook mail interface. Your mail interface might look a bit different if you're using a different email provider or a different version of Outlook, but the features are mostly the same. The primary part of your email interface is the inbox. This is where you can view all of the messages you've received. The messages are usually listed with the name of the sender, the subject of the email message, and the date and time the email was received. You can organize your messages into folders if you'd like. Those folders will appear in the Folders pane beside your message list. There are some folders that are typically included by default, like the Drafts folder for messages you haven't yet sent, the Sent Items folder for messages you have sent, and the Deleted Items folder for messages you've deleted. If you care for a little more organization, you can create new folders for your emails. Simply click on New Folder and type in the name that you'd like for your new folder. When you select an email from your inbox, you can view it in the Reading pane. From here, you can read a message and open any attachments that were included in that message. You also have options to reply to a message or forward it to others. If you want to file an email into a folder, you can either drag and drop the email from your inbox into that folder, or select the Move To option in the ribbon and select the folder from those options. When you select New Message at the top left, you are taken to the Compose pane, where you can write, edit, format, and send an email message. There are many more features of mail, but these are the primary parts of the interface that help you read, organize, reply to, and send email from your account.